update. Um, I am three days on tea, so really no changes to speak of. Um, I did notice that my voice is kind of raspy and it gets a little s sore or kind of hoarse in the morning. Or, But other than that, okay, it's only been three days. I guess there's nothing. So, um, but I, I did work out and I feel stronger already. Um, so, I don't know, I think changes are starting to happen really fast. Uh, maybe not fast enough, but you know, as fast as they should be, should be happening. So, um, but the reason, uh, also I, I wanted to talk about um, coming out to my parents. Um, my mom, she passed away in 2010, so uh, unfortunately she didn't know anything about how I felt and uh, this whole coming out process. Okay, there's my dog. Okay, go away. Uh, but my father's still alive and he's 81. Uh, he lives in California. I live in New Hampshire. That's like 2,000 miles away. Uh, so we really don't see each other that often. Um, and my mom and dad divorced when I was three. So it's not like we, you know, he really knows everything about me and we're really enmeshed together. So, but I've been struggling as to how to, t to tell him that I'm transitioning. And um, I, I just, I'm chicken, and I don't think I can do it over the phone. I kind of want him to, to, to read a letter. I, want, I wrote a letter. Here it is. And I want him to sit down and read it and absorb it and not have me just kind of like throw it at him on the phone. And then have him just react out of impulse or whatever. My dad is from another culture than I am basically, I mean, he is Indian, so um, that probably makes it even more hard for him, him to understand these kinds of things. Um, but anyway, I, 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 here's the letter, and I thought I would read the letter to you guys, and just if you have any feedback or you think it's horrible or Whatever, but anyway, this is what I'm going to send them, basically. Um, <clears throat> it says, Dear Daddy, I've been wanting to tell you something for, for some time, but I've struggled with how to do it. I know I should probably have called you instead of writing a letter, but I really wanted you to have time to absorb what I am telling you before we talk. Dad, what I want to tell you is that I am transgender. In case you don't quite understand what it is, it means that I feel like a man that is trapped in a woman's body. For most, for most of my life, I thought I was a lesbian because that was the only name for how I felt at the time. But after much soul searching, the reason I am attracted to women, to women is not because I am a lesbian, but because I am a man inside. I know this is probably very hard for you to understand. It's been hard for me too. All my life, I wanted to be a male. As a child, I was such a tomboy, which you know. But what you didn't know is that I didn't want to act like a boy. I wanted to be a boy. This is because my brain didn't develop the way my body did. It's no one's fault. It's just something that happens to some people. I'm okay with it. But after 50 years, 
I've decided to try to make my body a better match for my brain. So, I've started hormone treatment for my condition. I'm taking testosterone, which will make my voice deeper and my features more masculine. I'm doing this because it will make me a happier person. Sandy has been very supportive, as has Ben. They both want me to be happy, no matter what. I really want your support, too. I hope that you will love and accept me, even as I start to look more male. I love you, Daddy. Always, Tarita. P.S. Please call me when you are ready to talk about it. So, that's that. That's it. Um, I'm going to mail this off tomorrow as soon as I can. And um, hopefully he has a good response to that. And um, let's see. Today is Sunday. I have my next tee shot on Friday. That will be my one week update. So I'll be talking to you. See ya. Bye. No law is going to change us. We have to change us. Whatever God you believe in, we come from the same one. Strip away the fear, underneath it's all the same love. About time that we raised up. I can't Sex. Hate.